now we're going to take a look at how do we do some of these bait placements for palm trees. And I guess you were telling me that it's a little different than using like a creating a coniferous or a deciduous. Yeah, tree. it's you, you really can't drill a palm tree and put a liquid termitocide because the vascular system is completely different than the tree. Uh huh. Uh, it's very fibrous, all the living tissues on the inside. So if you drill it, it's going to cause create a, a havoc with the tree. Right. It's going to have a lot of bleeding out, and it's going to look really so nasty. No foam trees. No yeah, foaming, yeah. no right. foaming on these things. So the option you would have, I guess, would to put a liquid termitocide around the base uh -huh. by rotting it, or to put a, a bait station. Now the problem with these bait stations here is that you're going to drill a big hole. If you get too close. They have a very fibrous root system. Okay. So by getting too close, you're going to be injuring the roots. So I would recommend probably going maybe three to four feet away yeah. from the base of the tree. And then the palm tree. even if you get it in and you're like, I don't care about the roots, I'm going to put it in anyways. Right. Then well, you check I, it a year later and then check it a year later. And the problem is that the, uh, the, 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 the roots being very, very fibrous, they're going to get into the station. So. They're gonna go through all these little slits in here, uh -huh. and you're not gonna be able to, to check the bait. Yeah. There's gonna be a massive root system in there. So yeah. they're, they're with, they have some serious problems right. trying to do this. So palm trees are a little special. They're a little special. So, uh, <laughs> you know, don't get too close to them. You can injure the root system. Okay. And if you're too close, the roots are gonna, uh, you know, interfere with the station. You won't be able to check the station. Okay. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go look look about four or five feet out. out. I'm going to drill a hole, I'm going to install one of these two types of stations. One, you know, like I said, one's a two inch diameter, the other's a three inch diameter. Okay. A little different technique for drilling a hole. Yeah. But hopefully we can get it in there. Now, this, for, this would be the same as with other trees where typically you would do four per tree? Correct. It's still, a tree like this, uh, about four per tree. Okay. Four stations at the base of the tree. All right. Okay, so let's make some noise. Hopefully we get this thing to start again. <laughs> It's always a challenge. Isn't it? All right, let's try it right here. It doesn't seem as bad as the last. Doesn't seem as bad as the last. Uh, no, it's not. This is actually pretty good soil. It's not. It doesn't have as much clay. So we're gonna try this one first. Hopefully we can get it in without too much issue. Yeah. Wow. Perfect. All right. So notice that we didn't hit any roots. Right. Right. Uh, if, if I were to put it probably about here, it, the drill is going to have a hard time going through it because it's so fibrous right. in there. So again, four to five feet away and termites, termites will find Okay. It. So we'll drill a hole about this far away and uh, make it a little wider for the other side. Okay. Okay. a try. See if we can sink it in there. Get some soil out of the way. So it's still a little too tight. Almost, yeah. Maybe that'll work. There we go. Oh great. That's it. <laughs> 